Life is funny. Uh, I love being here at McQuaid. And then, when you have two daughters, you lose a little interest. <laughs> but life takes care of you. Pretty soon, you get four grandsons, and you think it's uh, time to reconsider. In, in the meantime, I had a good friend who was telling me about her experiences here uh, uh, of her son. And what she constantly would stress to me was how McQuaid truly cared about each individual here in the school. And it really impressed me. And uh, I'm glad I ended up with some grandsons that could take advantage of this. Now, when I was here, uh, I guess it was the older era, uh, I, really, I was a specialized in, in Latin, Greek, French, and English. I'm taking four Eng uh, languages. And uh, so I, I figured it was a little bit maybe time to make a change when we were here. That's, that's my, my view of this a little more. And as I'm walking around with Tim and Father Reiser, uh, we got talking about what kids were doing, and they were talking about the interest in, in these games and uh, robotics and things. And I, I thought back to, I guess we walked down the, the old hall of, um, uh, used to be, I called it the science area. And I remember getting the worst grade I got in McQuaid down there. <laughs> and I said to him, listen, if we're going to do this thing, I mean, shouldn't we do something? It's, that's what kids want today. That's what the world has changed. And we, we need to be good at science and technology if we're going to really train young people to uh, be great in the future. So. Uh, I'm th so thrilled about what's going on, and, and certainly uh, I've, nice during the service to talk about Wegmans, but th these are the real heroes here. So many folks have contributed to this effort, and I, I couldn't be prouder to be part of it, but I only a part of it, and so uh, I'm, I'm looking forward to, to, uh, to my grandsons uh, enjoying the new facility and doing great. Uh, so guys, knock it uh, to them, whatever it takes. Thank you.